This is CBS 5 News, telling it like it is. If you ever need back surgery, you're living in the right place because the Valley is home to a new robot that makes the surgery much safer and easier. We'll have that story right after the break. You're starting smart with the best conversation in the Valley. CBS 5 Morning News. Well, if you ever had back trouble, this may interest you. There's a new robot in town. It's the only one of its kind in Arizona. I like the sound of this. Uh, it has more accurate, less intrusive techniques when you have spine surgery. Katie went and talked to the doctor who brought it to the Valley to tell us all about it. That's Katie. right. Well, it cost a million dollars, so it's not cheap, but already this money. small robot, it's about this size, it's affected the lives of many folks in the Valley for the better. It got to the point to where I couldn't walk. Melvin Douglas is a champion wrestler turned coach. About a year ago, when his legs started going numb, he came to Dr. Terrence Crowder for help. Very subtle, but there's actually a fracture. Douglas needed surgery, and in this operation, Dr. Crowder wouldn't be working alone. We've actually come to a point where we can actually use robotics to help us do surgery. The new robot finds the spot where a screw needs to be placed into the spine. That process, before the use of the robot, used to be more dangerous and painful for the patient. Well, surgeries that used to need incisions that were four or five or six inches long and you had to strip muscle away and you actually have the patient in the hospital a week or maybe more. With the robot, doctors don't have to spread the muscle apart, so recovery time is much shorter. Using the robot, we can actually do surgery through very small incisions. Smaller incisions mean less blood loss. Plus, the robot increases the accuracy rate from about 80% to 98%. Yeah, I do. I feel good. I feel 35 again. <laughs> For Melvin, he was able to get out of bed the day after surgery. And three days later, he was back on the wrestling mat, thanks to Dr. Crowder and his robotic helper. So there's about seven of these um, Mesra robots in the country. And so we're pretty lucky to have it here in Arizona. And insurance covers it. So if you do need spine surgery, uh, it's not extra. You know, that's part of of the procedure that you could use this robot. So before the doctors were just trying to hit a spot with their hand. Right. Now it's it's much more accurate. Yes, and they before they would have to pull all the muscle back wow. and and you know an 80% isn't bad but 80% accuracy rate to 98 because they can see yeah. they use you know kind of an x-ray type technology to see so they don't have to pull all that muscle back so your recovery time is a day Lock instead worker. of six yes. weeks That's plus. Amazing. That's it is amazing. Fantastic. Because I think a lot of people who've had back surgery it's it's the You're muscle. Out. Yeah. that is hurting more than anything else. So I think it's a pretty exciting thing. He says that it's going to be, he thinks, like the cell phone. It's just going to catch on, and this technology is going Popular. to be used. Yep, pretty uh, widespread. Fascinating. Robots yeah. are doing everything. Mm -hmm. They're taking over in the world. Is, yes, they in are. In this instance, that's a good thing. Yes. That is a great thing. Yeah.